Michael Irvin and his attorneys fought hard for this video, said it would prove his innocence and said they wanted you to see it. Now the interaction between Irvin and this hotel employee, it lasts less than two minutes. We are going to speed up some parts of it though to walk you through it all. Their initial interaction is just partly obscured by a column in the lobby. Then they appear to shake hands, talk, and Irvin seems to touch her elbow briefly. She steps back. They keep talking, about 70 seconds pass. He touches her other elbow, laughs. They shake hands and walk away. Irvin looks back and appears to slap himself in the face. Irvin's attorney said the employee did not look uncomfortable to them and focused on a man several feet away who can be seen clapping, suggesting he, who they believe is the woman's manager, might have been angry with her for talking to Irvin. Of course, the one thing this video does not have, audio. On a radio show after this first happened, Irvin said he had a few drinks, didn't really remember the incident, but today said their conversation was about football, the shows he worked on, and where the employee could watch them. In a filing last week, Marriott claimed instead he made sexually explicit comments to the employee. Here is Irvin's response to that. So, you know, I, I, I don't speak like that. You know what I mean? I, I've never spoken like that. So I'm, I'm not even, yeah, I, I totally deny saying that. I totally deny saying that. And yesterday, Irvin voluntarily dismissed his $100 million lawsuit against Marriott, but immediately refiled a new one in Arizona, listing Marriott, the hotel operating company, and four individuals as defendants, including that hotel employee. We reached out to Marriott for a comment. A spokesperson said they have no comment at this time. In Dallas, I'm Sydney Persing.